Hey guys and what is up? So today I am going to be decorating my faith planner. Now um, I will be honest you guys I have been struggling with um, my faith planner lately. I have been see I didn't even do anything last week. I have been um, I shared with you all that I was sick there for a little bit and um, I'm still, I'm doing a lot better now, thankfully, but I was still trying to recover and then catching up with everything and life and work and, you know, everything. So, um, it's been a little hard to dedicate the time that I need to, to my faith planning. And this is something that I kept a part of my routine. Like in the morning, as soon as I woke up, this was done. Um, for some reason lately, it's just been a struggle, but I wanted to go ahead and decorate it anyways. And put, honestly, I'm not going to put any pressure to myself. If I end up faith planning, that is great, but I am going to make it a point to start making it a habit in September. So here's the spread that I have. This is the layout that I have. And these are the sticker books that I pulled out. Um, this is Good Habits, the Garden Flowers, the Marabou Designs, which is the new one that Happy Planner um, came out with at Joann's. It's available at Joann's, not available at the Happy Planner just yet, as well as um, the Spoonful of Faith by Jenna Holl Holiday. Um, so yeah, I'm going to go ahead and try to use these. I was really thinking about this one. I brought the Marabou Designs one out just in case, and I feel like there's some stickers that go really well with um, the Spoonful of Faith and Garden Flowers. So yeah, let's go ahead and get started and see what we can put together. So um, I did get the mini um, sticker book. I found it at Joann's, and I thought they had the big also, but I just figured the... Um, mini made a little bit more sense since none of my planners are in the um i don't have any big planners so this just made more sense for me um i really love this i'm not too sure the direction i want to go in i just know i had seen see like these right here I had seen these and i thought it would go really well with some of these so what do y'all think should we do that there's just also like the colors go really well together with like their greenery and i can add some butterflies or something so i think i am gonna go with um some of these but i'm gonna grab the paper ones <coughs> sorry i'm still trying to get past this cough this the cough just lingers on forever. So I'm thinking about somewhere right around here, more or less. So what I'm thinking, I'm gonna grab this one just to make sure. See, I'm not too sure if I wanna like start with something so big like this. Maybe I can just grab a few of the the little ones the smaller ones to like kind of build up from there so maybe i'm just gonna stick this down right there now there's clear ones also so maybe we'll just grab some of the clear ones That. I am going to stick that down because I think mean, that's what I like. Why not? So I want a different one. Like that. Okay, I don't think it looks the best, um, honestly, but it's fine. It's no big deal. I did want some of the butterflies that are at the front. I thought adding some of these 
would be cute throughout like a planner or something. It's cute for now. Um, okay, I think I'm going to add I know I had some of the stickers that came with the extension pack so I'm just going to grab these really quick because I could use those at one point I don't know how I feel about this. Does that look bad? You guys, I'm struggling. I feel like I should have used the box instead or put her all the way in the corner. But um, I feel like I'm kind of stuck with it. So that's fine. I'm just gonna keep it as is and go with it, honestly. So here we go. <laughs> Maybe I can add like a box right here or something. Maybe I can save the spread. So, here we go. <laughs> Ain't no turning back now. This just goes to show that, like, just go with it. Like, <laughs> try to, like, figure it out or something, like, you know. Sometimes, like, that's what you have to do. And by the way, I'm sorry, if y'all hear any um, background noise, I do have um, my washer going, So, and I forgot to close my door. So there's that. Today's just like one of those days, y'all. <laughs> I think I'm all over the place, kind of, because my... You guys, I was having like a struggle. I was on a struggle bus this week um, my husband went out of town he is going to vegas with his friends and um he went to vegas he left this afternoon this like around noon and um we're really like never away from each other like ever <laughs> and um I was just having a hard time with it because I think ever since I started having a lot of my mental health issues lately, um, he's been the person that has kept me, like he, he's the one that holds me together, you know, he's, he's my glue <laughs> and um, it's the first time we'll be away from each other and I'm honestly getting emotional right now. Um, it's the first time we'll be away from each other in a long time and I'm struggling with it because he's going to be miles and miles away. He's not going to come back until um, Sunday. So that's going to be hard. And um, yeah, I mean, I, I can't do anything about it. You know, like it's just that's what it is like. And I think, like, had I asked him, like, I don't want you to go or something, he would have stayed. Um, the reason he's going up there is because his friend is getting married in October. And so they're going to go for his bachelor bachelor party. I was about to say bachelorette, but it's for his bachelor party. And um, that's what they're going up there for. And so... I, I didn't want him to miss out, like, you know, like, because I'm selfish. <laughs> and I shouldn't say selfish, but realistically, like, my parents live down the street. Like, if I needed to, I could easily, I mean, it's not, like, down the street, but they live, like, less than, like, five miles away. So if I needed to, I could just drive over there and be over there in just a few minutes and, you know, I'd be fine. But... It's just a little hard, just a little bit. 
that I'll be okay. And I think that's why I'm a little off because I just keep thinking about it. He, um, I dropped him off at the airport like around 11. And um, that was like, like what, like maybe less than three hours ago. So I think that's why I'm still like a little off. <laughs> But I'll be all right. I will be okay. I have a lot planned out for today. Um, not for today, for the entire weekend, I should say. Um, I planned out this live, honestly, for the reason being that I was going to be alone. And I thought it would give me something to do. And um, so I planned that out for today. And then tomorrow, I'm just going to have like a super chill day, going to make sure that I finish out a lot of the, the content stuff that I wanted to, to get done. So it's going to be like a content day. And then um, on Saturday, I'm going to, this is crooked. I'm notorious for putting stickers on crooked. And okay, let me fix that. And um, what was I saying? On Saturday, I'm going to go hang out with my friend who uh, lives in in Austin, Texas. And she is, um, her, hus her husband, her um, fiance is who is getting married. He's the one that they went to for his bachelor party. And um, yeah, I think it would be great. I'm going to go spend the weekend with her not the entire weekend but um i'm gonna spend saturday with her and so i think that is great for us both so we're not like alone or anything like that and you know keep each other company which is amazing and um yeah so i'm gonna do that on saturday and then on sunday i have my friend who, I think I told y'all about it, my friend who is getting married in December, she wanted me to do some some pictures for her because, uh, like engagement pictures basically. And they've already been, they've been engaged for a while now, like before the pandemic, but because of the pandemic, they didn't get to do much. And so she asked me to take pictures for her. So I'm gonna do that on Sunday. So I have like, a weekend filled of like stuff to do so like I won't be alone or anything like that like I'll have plenty of things to do so that's a plus it's just still a little hard because like my soulmate's gonna be gone you know <laughs> it's just that's the hard part but thankfully you know I got plenty of stuff to do I got my family literally down the street my friends are um, really close by and I have a lot to do. I have a lot here at home. So I'm thankful for that. Um, intentions for the month. Okay. So I thought there was a, um, like trackers. Oh, here they are. So I think I can use this pink one. I always like putting, um, trackers in my monthly and my monthly and my um faith because it helps me actually try to be on top of it so i'm putting it off the page because all i literally write is like faith or a reading or you know something so simple that i don't need this entire thing for it um last thing i wanted to do is look through this one to grab some more little plants so it doesn't look so naked i was gonna grab some more of the butterflies maybe like two more yeah two more and then let me grab some of these Like right there. I 
I honestly hate um, covering the whole punch sections <laughs> because I am so lazy and I don't want to repunch it. So I'm just going to figure out somewhere where to put this. Maybe like right here or something. Cute. Perfect. Well, this actually, I feel like it turned out a little bit better than what I thought it would. So that looks really good. Um, it tied in together quite well. So that looks good. I love it, actually. And this little cluster looks really cute, too. So, um, yeah, I think I'm going to go ahead and um, stop it here before I fill out the page with, like, a ton more stickers. Um, I kind of felt like it was missing something right here, but I'm just going to leave it as is and not overdo it. Um, but if you enjoyed this video, please give me a thumbs up. And if you want to watch more of my videos, please subscribe and I will see you all next time. Bye.